celebrate the Italian National Day in this symbolic venue at People House. We're also in front of the Italian Hall, which will host very soon the Italian American Museum of Los Angeles by Italiana. This evening is the result of a combined effort of many people and many organizations whose role will also be acknowledged throughout this wonderful evening. As you know, this is we are celebrating tonight the 67th anniversary of our beloved Republic. 67 years ago, uh, the uh, Italians were coming together to choose the former government and they chose the Republic and here we are, 67 years later. Uh, we've gone a long way and we're very proud of our country. As you know, As you know, uh, Italy, like uh, many other countries in the world, is going through a uh, uh, tough time in terms of uh, economic challenges that lie ahead of us. Um, we've had uh, a, uh, an economic crisis that we're, uh, we're uh, still dealing with. And, uh, but the Italian people are very resilient, and so is the economy of this great country. Um, we've had, as you know, elections uh, a few months ago in February, and as a result, uh, we do have now a new government, and the new government is committed to bringing the country back to a path of, uh, of growth, of economic growth, and uh, of a reduction of unemployment. And clearly, this requires the commitment of all Italians who uh, are called upon doing their, their part, each one in his own area. So they need to come together much in the same way as they did in 1946 when they chose this formidable path for our country. But uh, we are here tonight, as Clarissa was saying, in this spectacular, uh, spectacular place, as is uh, Pico House, and the more I look at it, and the, the more beautiful I see it, I, I, I see it. It's, it's just a fantastic place and, I'm, and I hope that you guys are enjoying it as much uh, as I am. Uh, as you know, uh, we are here in the heart of Little Italy, where, where Italians uh, came to LA in the uh, late 1800s, early 1900s and established themselves. We are across the street from another incredible, important monument, uh, landmark for Italians, which is Italian Hall. And which is the place that will host uh, very soon the first Italian American Museum in Los Angeles. <laughs> and the people who are working for it are very committed and dedicated, and I would like, I wanted you to uh, give them a round of applause, but that was <laughs> Um, since last year, we've, uh, we've, many, we've done many things. The Italian institutional presence in LA has done many things. As you know, the, the Consulate General in Los Angeles has a new uh, headquarters, a new office in, uh, in the Century City. It's, uh, it's a beautiful uh, building and a beautiful space for those of you who have not yet visited. And we're very proud because it lives up uh, to the standards of uh, the, the aesthetic standards of our country. So, those of you who, was, who have not uh, visited yet, we urge you to come and visit uh, soon. The, uh, I would like now to introduce uh, a few people who are actually our uh, guests of honor of tonight, starting with. Um, an official who is really a landmark for the city of Los Angeles, having been elected since 1998, which is quite astonishing, and that's a demonstration of how much people of Los Angeles love him. He is the head of the largest sheriff department in the country, is Sheriff Leroy Barker. Good evening. Our great council general, is he a fantastic person? here as long as we possibly can. But God bless all of you for being here, all of us who have ever had the privilege of going to the great country of Italy. And I've certainly been there myself from Lago de Roma to Sardinia. 
And I believe that what we all have in common, if you have gone to Italy, is that you come back partly, if you're not already, I tell you. Uh, this is a great society that has huge impact in terms of its history. Uh, the idea that Rome uh, was also a part of the process of Rome was in, was in Constantinople, which was the second Rome, and then Moscow was the third Rome. And when you look at the whole history of the Italian society, there's a lot to admire, a lot to love, and a lot to enjoy. Thank you so much. The reason why the President of the Italian Republic uh, has decided to bestow this important decoration on uh, Bruno Serrano is because Bruno, with uh, his daily work, his daily activity, embodies the principles and the values that are most quintessentially Italian, which is generosity, service to the others, family, because with these children, Bruno, you have really created the family. I know how much these children uh, love you and how much they uh, look after you.